Uh, right, welcome back. This is Minyak. Uh, oh, welcome back to another video for World of Warship. Okay, this time I am going to show you guys the, my replay of the Queen Elizabeth. So I'm go just going to title this video uh, Long Live the Queen. Okay, yeah. Okay, if you like this type of video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. All right. So why do I actually have a battleship video? <laughs> I don't actually play battleship, but yeah, right now, um, grinding for the uh, was that the British cruiser event. Uh, one of the requirement is to get. I think if I'm not mistaken, the 60 fire from a battleship. So, yeah, while grinding for the uh, one of the mission directive. I am playing the Queen Elizabeth. Okay, this is a British uh, battleship. Well, a little bit about these. Well, this battleship is that the it has eight guns, 381 millimeter. I forgot I have how many inches of that. Hmm. Probably close to 16 inches. No, actually, it's 14 inch. Okay, so the gun is quite big. Okay, for a tier 6 battleship. Good thing about this uh, Queen Elizabeth is the fire chance. You know, if you're the mission asking for battleship that's to create fire and devastating strike, British uh, battleship is actually one of the best one to create fire. Yeah, this ship, uh, well the British battleship has a fire rate chance of 35% fire chance using HE and if, when this one actually oh yeah hmm. my captain is a nine point captain so it has demolition expert to improve the fire chance so my fire chance is about 37% so yeah th this is the British battleship is the perfect, uh, well, the perfect battleship to create um, fire. That's why when the mission asks for you know, creating 60 fire with thing using a battleship, the choice that is uh, that comes to my mind is yeah, British British battleship is good for fire. Okay, yeah, the torpedo protection is about. 22% so yeah it will reduce the damage of those 22% is not it's okay I guess so yeah and the, the speed the own well since this is a battleship yeah the speed of the battleship is very very slow so I'm just third it's like a turtle the maximum speed is 23.5 not but yeah you won't reach that the, the maximum well rarely reach the maximum speed of 23.5 so you probably moving on average is 20 knots so this is a slow ship well it armed it is armored and well very slow okay so I am there are hmm or destroyer in this game so yeah without any carrier so I have to aim for all the destroyer first and using HE is the perfect chance well the perfect weapon to kill uh, well, destroyer the only problem is I have to you know have people spot the uh, destroyer for me Okay, I am aiming at the web part. Yeah, I'm hiding behind this tiny island. Well, so that if they uh, the destroyer dropped torpedo, I can aim. Well, it will hit the island first. Yeah, probably this is partially because I play cruiser. 
Oh, I'm hiding behind the island, shooting from over the island. Yeah, exactly like, uh, exactly like it. Yeah, but I don't have to worry about getting hit because this is a battleship. All I have to do is uh, keep keep the angle. Well, keep the angle of my armor. Arizona is actually powerful. Oh, because it's premium. Okay. Hmm. Okay, this game is the tier 5 to tier 7. So I am in tier 6 battleship. Yeah. We yeah, are making advantage of the high fire chance. So I'm using H. Oh, most of the time I'll be as I can. At the airport. Yep. Well, it's unlucky for him. Detonation. Uh, it always, it sometimes it happens. It happened to a uh, destroyer. Very unlikely a detonation happened to a battleship, but it sometimes happened. You have a detonation on the battleship. Well, that's just not luck. Okay, aiming now at the Arizona. Yeah, well, to fire. Yeah, he is burning, definitely burning. Yeah, one the thing about battleship is that you have to wait before you could uh, you actually use damage repair party. If you have uh, one fire, and you use. Damage repair party, then next fire started, then you won't have access to damage repair, which is that will be bad, especially in the battleship where the fire can last to, to up to about what a minute. Yes, okay, I don't have to worry about the Italian. Crew. He's shooting AP. Zara is shooting AP at me. It's not going to make a difference because I'm still a battleship. Even though Zara has a higher, higher tier cruiser. Well, it cannot. It can use sap shell, but it won't burn my ship. If it's angle. Yeah, actually, he should be using uh, sap shell instead of. At least it will create more damage well, to me. And again, who am I to tell my enemy how to play their ship, right? Yeah, I'm still using HE. Probably they. Some people will. Uh, some people will think that uh, using HE on the battleship is a nuke move. Hey, but this is British. Hey, mate, this is British. And British... British battleship burns stuff. Which is actually weird. Uh, well, you can you still use AP for, like, who's a... Like, this Zara, probably I could use and kill him. But uh, I think I saw a Mini Kazem next to me, so I'm not quite sure that I use, should use AP or uh, HE. Yeah, I'll just stick to HE. Yeah, because the, if you are up against the destroyer, you want HE gel toward the uh, destroyer. Uh, so that you can actually create like a uh, incapacitate destroyer. Direct front. If you use AP on the destroyer, it will work. But uh, what do you call the AP can over penetrate the destroyer. So it is actually better if you use HE toward the destroyer. Yeah, the Minikaze is popping up smoke. 
Okay, Zara is in front of me, next to me is a mini Aze, so yeah, it's going to be a torpedo. Yeah, the Gaide is also in front of me. Fiji is having a death wish. I don't know why the Fiji is not using smoke. Fiji is a way, even though Fiji is not a bad ship. Well, it's a, not a bad ship. If you know how to use smoke and then shoot from inside the smoke, but other than that, the Fiji is uh, the, the armor of the Fiji. Garbage. Yeah. So you, hmm. if you charge uh, forward using a Fiji, uh, okay, I'm still looking in a cousin next to me and guide So, okay, I will just aim. I'm aiming at the guide first. Oh. Okay, uh, torpedo incoming from Mimina Kaze. Okay, I am just going to try to kill this idiot first. Okay. Enemy destroyer blown up. Tara is behind the island, so I cannot do much about it. Okay, Mimina Kaze should be inside the smoke right here. Inekaze has a very good uh, torpedo reload time. Okay, have to take torpedo and use the damage there. So flooding. Okay, I'm in the pickle. I'm very, very much in the pickle. Either I point my bow toward the Minikaze or I point my bow toward the uh, things, you know. The game can actually citadel me if I'm not careful. Okay, torpedo in probably turn. Drop torpedo. Turn. Okay, angle toward the uh, grenade. Just... Yep. Okay, this is uh. <laughs> okay, I'll point my stern. Okay, an incoming torpedo. Okay, just have to turn. Turn. Okay. Uh, I guess the grenade is mm, still reloading. Okay, turn, turn, turn back. Okay, so point, I'm pointing my bow toward the uh, grenade. So yeah, angling it. Yeah, I'm going to burn the grenade. Okay. Yeah, this ship is very slow. 20, 20 knots. The grenade has stopped. In front of him, on the side. Okay, turning. Turning again, turning, turning. Okay, Mine Kaze is incoming. Okay, I am just going to shoot. Yeah, yeah I'm not going to move. Right, there are. Hmm, let me see one. Okay, three ships left. Two cruiser from the enemy and another Queen Elizabeth. Well, the Queen Elizabeth again going up against the, uh, the Mutsuki. And also what? Okay, going to the sea. And New York is also charging, so I'm just going to have him as my... Well, hopefully the enemy is going to target the... No lucky... What is it? No lucky day again. What? What? Why the name is like that? I don't know. Okay, so he will be my unlucky shield. <laughs> no lucky again. Okay, the uh, Honisberg is actually targeting the New York. Okay, that's kind of good. Yeah, if the Honisberg is dumping torpedo, I hope that it hit the New York first. <laughs> well, that is just. Uh, Making use of your uh, ally. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, let your ally take the torpedo hit. And you are hiding behind me. Okay, I'm changing to um, AP since there are only cruiser. Yeah, shell. Man, battleship is not that difficult. It's just, uh, just have to know which uh, which shell to use at what you know against what ship. Actually, the come to think of it, my Queen Elizabeth. Uh, the stat is really bad. I think I have only 30% win on Elizabeth. <laughs> so this this is this game is an anomaly for me. Probably because I play so many, you know, so much uh, cruiser that uh, my playstyle on the battleship also changes. Okay, I am going to take the kill shot on the Conisberg. Yeah, well, AP. Okay, so this game I got six six fire plus one yeah one citadel yeah so this is actually a good ship to well to grind for the emission British ship fire and citadel okay yeah the point is almost over. I am just going to go over. Battle ends in five minutes. I'll try to get the uh, well, kill the Devon Sire, but I don't think I have enough time because the point is almost. Merkin Muffly, Muffly, Muffly. Yep. Well, uh, well, the, yeah. I cannot kill the Devon Shire because the time is over. Uh, yeah, the point is already over. Okay, let me pull up. Okay, this is the win rate. So, yeah, I only get, I only got two thousand seven hundred uh, XP, but this is I don't have any more premium count. Yeah, my premium account expired when well, actually. I think I spent like two months premium when I was grinding the Puerto Rico. Now I don't have a premium account. I don't think I I need a premium account right now until they are a big big event again. So yeah, this is two thousand seven well, two thousand seven hundred seventy. Yeah, the three XP is only one hundred thirty nine. But I got cracking on this game. Using a battleship that I well, I suck at using Queen Elizabeth but uh, yeah it happens yeah the score okay this is the team score yeah 1851 base exp uh, five kills I uh, Kraken actually this is kind of surprising for me because uh, my win rate on, 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 on Queen Elizabeth is only 30% but yeah who, do, well, who would I have thought yeah, long live the queen. All right. Okay. Uh, this is the end of the video. Uh, thank you for watching. I will see you guys on the next video. This is Minyak signing off.